published 1351 EDT, the 26th of August 2017 updated 1351 EDT, the 26th of August 2017 Barnsley secured their second Skybet Championship win of the season as they comfortably beat Sunderland 30 at Oakwell. An Ikugbo goal and strikes from Harvey Barnes and George Monker were the least Barnsley deserved in a convincing win over a lackluster visiting side. Sunderland were very nearly given a 4-2 at a start to the game in the fourth minute when George Honeyman and Lewis Graben found themselves 2-1 against Adam Jackson. Honeyman's cross was almost diverted into his own net by Jackson. Oakwell was rocking on Saturday as Barnsley thrashed Sunderland 30 in the championship. Chelsea Loney Ikugbo scored his first ever championship goal to put the Tykes in front. Brad Potts went close for Barnsley in the 12th minute when Lamine Kone failed to shepherd the ball out of the play but his effort was well wide of the goal. Barnsley continued to press and missed a fine chance in the 30th minute when Adam Hamill cut inside from the right to deliver a perfect cross for Potts, but his header lacked any power and was easy for Robin Reuter to save. The opening goal came shortly after in the 31st minute, with Reuter unable to get any distance on his parry from Barnes' effort on the left side. Chelsea Loney Ugbo was the first to react to the loose ball to bundle the ball into the Sunderland net. It was 20 in the 35th minute, when Barnes got on the end of a poor clearance from Kone and his volley rocketed into the net to a rapturous ovation from the Oakwell faithful. Midfielder Harvey Barnes, who is on loan from Chester City, then made it 20 to Barnsley. George Monker then completed the route midway through the second half in South Yorkshire. Sunderland were unlucky not to have a man advantage when James Vaughan was clattered in the 43rd minute by Liam Lindsay, with Vaughan only on one with goalkeeper Adam Davies. Referee Chris Cavanaugh let the defender off with a booking. Barnes could have made it three in the 60th minute when he got on the end of a deep cross from Hamill from the right side. The header from Barnes was a difficult one at a tight angle and his effort went over the bar. The Tykes sealed the three points in the 67th minute with a counterattack. Ugbo picked the perfect moment to slide in Monker on the left side of the box and he finished into the near post. It nearly got worse for Sunderland when substitute Wabi Kosri tried a flick in his own half, only to be robbed by Jason McCarthy who charged towards goal before firing a shot wide. Sunderland offered little of any quality or effort in the second half with Barnsley comfortably allowed to see out the rest of the game and claim a much-needed victory. Sunderland manager Simon Grayson looked understandably concerned with the result.